I'm Bill Scott, and this is History Minute. The day the music died. On 3rd February 1959, iconic musicians Buddy Holly, Richie Valens, and J.P. Richardson, also known as the Big Bopper, played a show in Clear Lake, Iowa, on the middle of a winter tour. The next stop was Moorhead, Minnesota. After enduring numerous bus problems beforehand, including a breakdown in Wisconsin, Holly opted to take a charter flight. Future country star Waylon Jennings played bass for Holly and originally had a seat on the plane but gave it to Richardson. Valens won a seat on the plane after a coin toss with his guitarist. The plane took off from the runway at Clear Lake, but it never had the chance. It crashed into cornfield, killing all three stars and the pilot. The music world mourned those up-and-coming artists. Don McLean wrote about it in the song American Pie and referred to it as the day the music died, the way it is remembered today. I'm Bill Scott, and this was History Minute.